All right, where are we? Where are we with our health? We're not doing too bad, really low MP. Let's get that addressed really quickly. Um, we've got some items that will help with that, surely. We have a lot of those 1000 HP recovering essences. That's really good. Not a lot of neophyte syrups though, but you know what, that's okay. It's just her, it's just Oiki that needs it. Everybody else is okay. Do we have anything that will increase our stuff? Cure minutely, cure minutely. The arcs, the arcs candy. Uh, coated in contagion is only capable with lots of cloth. Car, carvable. Uses a one-time weapon in, in battle. Does ashen damage. Ashen damage. We could gain happy. We could gain happy. I won't worry about it. I'm not gonna worry about it. Plus 10 MP. Is that? Is this permanent? Didn't pay enough attention. Dunno. It's gone now. Um single use outside of combat. Rest and gain some XP and TP. We'll, we'll keep that. We'll keep that. It'll be, um... They are, uh... It's fine. It's fine. Actually, can I buy? Can I buy? Can I buy more Neophyte Syrup? No. I can, yes. Actually, that's great. But, um... We don't have what it takes money-wise. So, something I've been curious about. There's a demon thing over here. And he might be a friend. He might be a friend. It does seem as though... No, he's not trying to attack us. He's not moving. Oh. Oh, he's, he's a monster. Okay, good. Okay. Okay. Check out that art. Biblically accurate angel, let's go. Hi, welcome back to the channel. I'm Amalgam Ash. You can call me Ash. We're all friends here. We're all adults. We're all consenting to shortening our names. And you, hi. Jen? Fia? Bob? Pop. Nobody's name is Bob. Is this Samuel? It's been a while. How are you doing? Good. You look good. We need to figure out what's going to kill this thing as quickly as possible or else die. Um, mono eye damage. We'll go ahead and do a colony elder beast. Mono eye damage. Sounds good to me. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of plasma steel. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She's going to do a funny joke. Of course, what's mind grab? That must be new. I think I, I leveled up and got that. Oiki poorly controls an allied, citing their moves for three turns while making them unable to die and healing them. Oh, that is so cool. Using the power of an ancient elemental gemstone, slice an enemy and doom them against random elements. Funny joke, funny joke. And the priestess of Flora is un uncontrollable. <clears throat> they were weak to that? that was, they were weak to that? Oh, that's awesome. Weak to all of that. That is so cool. Ouch, ouch. Weak to thunder. I don't like that. Okay. Okay. That's that's okay. We can still... Okay, soul slice. That was very effective. Uh, Magic-wise. I don't think I used anything magic-wise. I think it was just special. Plasma steel. Plas you were weak against it, so I'm going to do it again. And then... Special. Uh... Uh... The star is happiness, right? I think everybody's still happy. So I can't worry too much about that one. Solidarkian will. Heals at the end of every turn. I've been informed that's a good thing, so we're gonna do Solidarkian will. We've all got HP regen. We're not gonna be contagioned this time. Nightmare wave. What do we got going on here? Heavy attacks. Looks like... Ooh, Oiki's gonna need to heal. Oh, that was a substantial heal. I like that. I like that very much. Thank you. Have a soul slice. Have a plasma steel. Really enjoying that stuff. We'll do a heal beam. I think. What's disease cliff? <clears throat> Deal elementless and max HP base damage that you gain as HP. <sighs> Love that. The exploding purple shards can cause many powerful ailments. Love that. 
we'll use that. Oh! They healed themselves for a little bit. The beast has thrown itself into a rage. It's time for phase two. Time for phase two. Bleeding. Bleeding. Counter. Ooh. The priestess of Flora is tough. She's not our scrub. She's not a pushover like the lady who died at the hands of my removing of her weak will back in the forest. Still feel really bad about that. Is what it is. Soul slice. Special plasma steel. Um, she's gonna need to heal herself for sure. So she's just gonna kameha meha the heal beam at her own face. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Not dying. Probably going to. Uh, whoa, Priestess of Flora's got Shadow Strike. She is so cool. Found the waifu of this game for me. Um, <clears throat> it was Mehedabel. Uh, out of combat, it's Mehedabel, but in combat, it's the Priestess of Flora. So, uh, again, Soul Slice, because it's just working out great. Plasma Steel. This is. Oh, crap. Oikyu's asleep. I needed to heal Servitor. I need to pay attention to when things like that happen. We're going to kill him. Yeah! Call me Elder Beast. Down you go. Three level ups is almost four. It's really close to that. Uh, f I would say max HP. That's a that's a generous little amount. Definitely good. Everything else is just trickling on, trickling on. Uh, agility boost and waves of exhaustion. Great job, Behetabel. Significant max HP boost. Trickles, trickles. Solidarks glare. Solidarks Glare. I got a Shield of Solidarks, an Eye of the Watcher, and a Seed Bag, and 1300 Dosh. That is worth going back to the save point, as long as I'm careful and don't run into any more uh, bad guys, which there are a few walking around this map still. Yeah, he's, oh you know, yeah, god, he's right there. We don't want to run into them. Still walking around the map. I missed the save point. I am a fool. Let's go ahead and equip what we need to equip really quick. Um, there was a shield. He's got the Book of Bullet Dodging. That multiplies defense and magic defense by 110%. That grants the skill armor fuse in special. Crit evasion, 12 counter. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that to him. He's got a great shield already. Mehdebel. Mm, can't change her shield. Not allowed. She'd probably die if I took it off of her. Oh. Uh, oh, and nobody can have that shield, evidently. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I've, I've been doing well without armor fuse. The, the buffs besides just don't seem to be, like, worth it, so I'm not going to worry about it just yet, huh? What else do I have? Diary. We'll go ahead and sacrifice this. Max mentality. Who needs it? Who needs it? Probably you. Oh, it's a gaining item, not a thing that does the thing where you get it permanently. Crap. Oh well. <clears throat> Adds one of every single seed bag is so great. We're going to go with Solid Servitor again. Eye of the Watcher can be used in battle, never runs out. Oh, wow. Man, I tell you what. I think that's all. I think that's all. And I was going to use the... The purity powder I was just going to sell. Crap, 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 crap. We got we to gotta find this, this area right here. Purity powder we're just going to sell. I don't need to have it when I have the ability to just sell the crap out of it. Now I have lots of money. Um, do I want nine arcs candy? I don't think I need nine of them. I'm not allowed to sell it. Crawler fangs? Ooh. Wow. We'll sell one. We'll sell one. 
We'll just sell the one. Harbinger jelly, I don't really need like 10 TP. If I get to where I have to rely on items to give me 10 TP, even in clutch, I'm not playing the game right. So we're gonna put that away. Uh, now, weapons, armors. I can go ahead and sell the unprotective dress. Sell the protective cloak. Oh, wow. 4,000. Yeah, let's do it. The protection spell. I keep it. Glowing feather. There's a lot of really cool things here. Uh, I really like the roses of iron. I'm going to keep that for now. That grants a skill. And I'm going to keep the shield of solid with special items. I, don't, I can't sell those yet. Buy. What can we buy? We can buy whatever we want now. Um, <clears throat> the firearm skill type and many abilities. I feel like this would be worth trying out. Uh, and then the tin enchanted armor. We could use that for our Priestess of Flora at the very least, right? I think it's a good idea. I think it's a good idea to try. So we'll grab that. I'll go ahead and grab this at the risk of regret. Uh, and we'll go ahead and equip that to our Priestess of Flora. Not what I wanted to do. No, there we go. Change. Robes of Solidarx to the Tin Enchanted Armor. Just massive amount of defense. Very sizable magic defense. And then the Robes of Solidarx, which I don't think she was really wearing to begin with. Let us see. Is it better to change her into his former wear? No. No, and we could go ahead and sell the robes of Solidarx. Oh, we got a guy. We got a guy. We got to go ahead and save real quick. Yeah, let's go. But why do you have Solidarkian auras coming off you? Intruders! For aligning with Solidarx, you must die. Okay, I know what to do here now. The freezing terraformer must die, and must die fast. So we're going to soul slice him. Uh, she's just going to attack. I think he was weak to that. Oh, weak, he's going to tell a funny joke. <clears throat> there was no effect on the Priestess of Flora because she was already happy. Oh, Mahedabel's attack is weak. We can't just do that. Noctavox Shade. Soul Slice. Ow. Ouch. Ouch. Oof, my ouchie. Such a happy little song. So, Bobby, look at that little floating purple skull above that terraformer. We're gonna crush him so, so much. Soul Slice was okay. Uh, do I care about doing... Yeah, 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 yeah. Shadow Disrupt. That sounds great. Let's do that. And then, uh, you... Let's do a Plasma Steel on the Freezing Terraformer. You... You, you, you. We're going to go ahead and grab Solidarkian Will, I think. So that everybody heals after everything. Hmm? Let's do that. I'm going to pay attention to this loadout's effectiveness. Funny joke, Solidarkian Will. That's my opener for Oiki. Because these jerks kind of hurt. Ow. Took away my happiness. Now Oiki needs to... <clears throat> yes. Yes. That was so good. Do it again. He was weak to it. Um, plasma Steel against the Freezing Terraformer again. This time she's going to have to heal. She's got to heal somebody. She's got to heal. She's got to heal. She's got to heal. Servitor. Once I know... They could use about a thousand, which that was less than a thousand. Yes! Destroyed you. I feel much better about my previous failure. We want to go ahead and get rid of all of these on-map enemies, so I don't have to worry about them running into me while I'm going about doing my stuff. 
because when I go outside, it's going to be because I've had enough of the interior of the, the little legacy dungeon rooms here that we're going to be visiting. And I certainly don't want them to... Okay, was that a was that a knock to shadow disrupt? Uh, Mono I think this should be fine. I think it should be fine. I think it should be fine. Special, you don't have sprouting powder. Random positive. Nah, we won't worry about that. And I've never tried it before, but nah, I won't. I won't. I won't worry about it. Knock to Vox shade. Mm -hmm. Yeah, why not? Use it. Do it. She can tell a funny joke again. She's just over here cracking jokes. Just making a whole mockery of this entire battle. Every battle that they're in, she's got something witty to say. I, I don't think I'll be alive much longer, sister. Make it out of this fight for me. Spread my legacy. Spread my leg. I see. Well, you, you guys aren't going to get the chance to do that stuff. Because we're about to destroy you. I don't think I paid any attention as to whether or not that was going to do any good. Um, <clears throat> yes, Maya, what do I want to do with her? Do I want to attack them? I would like to attack them, yeah. Disease Glyph, Light Coil, Disease Glyph, Disease Glyph. Let's use Disease Glyph. Oh, okay, Noctavox Shade, They're, they resist that, but it still does quite a bit of damage. Oh, she's bleeding badly. Okay, and she can resist his Shadow Knife. She countered. That's so cool. Okay, so no more Shadow Disrupt. How about Soul Slice? I can't remember if Soul Slice was good. And then uh, she'll just do a Concussive Slam. And then she will do straight up attack. What's her attack look like now? Ew. Is she going to say the thing too when she gets low on health? Or is it set up to where she only will say that if there's another one? Like, they're not going to talk to themselves. Spread my legacy, she said to no one. Servitor's ritual. Degrading cut. Servitor strike. And we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do a regular attack with her. We'll do a funny joke, which is free, by the way. It's free to tell jokes. It's free to tell jokes in this world. Oh, she resists that. Not good. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> they did. We've got two levels. Learned Magic Pulse. Don't have to... Don't have to learn Magic Pulse through an item now. I'm here because I forgot completely that I was gonna uh, equip somebody with a gun. Let's do that. Will she do it? No. Not at all. The higher her magic damage, the more powerful her healing is. I'm gonna have to remember that. I'm afraid I completely forgot. Is it just you then? No? Or is that not where that gets equipped? No, it gets equipped to the accessory. Unlocks powerful nightmare attacks for use. Um... Can I know which skills are nightmare based? Nightmare Soul Shock. So Soul Slice. Ugh, I like those. I like those a lot. I don't want to do that. Let's. How about Oiki? Cthulhu Light Rings. Completely resist paralysis. You know, let's do it. Floating Flintlock. Ooh, that brings her defense way down. I don't like that at all. Mm. Who else? Who else do we have? Can we give the gun to Mehedabel? The defense circulate. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're going to go ahead and give it to Oiki. On the basis that while she'll suffer in what she loses at defense, it's not going to be nearly as much as what uh, happens to Mehedabel. What you got? Firearm. Gunfire. Does more damage than your knife basic attack. Reload. Recovers a small amount of HP depending on user's attack. Gains 7 TP. 
Crackshot Freezer deals magic ice damage based on physical defense and double shot. Gain 1 TP for each hit. They said knife. She doesn't have a knife. So I'm wondering if this was definitely tailored for Servitor to use. Like, you get a choice. Nightmare abilities or firearm. But I want both. I did save, right? Okay. Now, there's a third guy walking around here. Who's all like, I'm walking here. There he is. Oh, we don't have to worry about... We don't have to worry about uh, this stupid terraformer. Hmm. Okay. So, Arcing Blade. Let's go ahead and attack everybody at once. And then, uh... Magic. Ice Drop. Does more damage to Flame Strap and Ice Elements. Let's do Ice Drop. See how they react to that. Firearm. Let's go ahead and, um... Uh, crack Shot Freezer. On the assassin. Boom. Oh, she's poisoned. I like that. Not a bad damage output. Not terrible. <clears throat> oh, she summoned the fire wisp. I forgot they could do that. The last ones didn't do that at all. Uh. Sing? Soul Slice was, like, weak, but not terrible. We gotta get rid of her because she summoned that thing, and if we kill that thing first, she could summon another one. Uh, Waves of Exhaustion. Love that. Play a melody by turning the shape of a shell into sound. Puts two random enemies to sleep and poisons them. The less turns they can take, the better, my opinion. I want to tell a funny joke. Everybody's mostly happy, though, already, so we'll go back to Firearm, and we'll do Double Shot. Yes. Of course she'd wake up, though. Speed is just an issue. Love that. Love that. It's hard to keep up enough to be able to form a pretty persistent strategy. I think my opener makes sense, but I'm still kind of figuring out what people are weak to and having... I mean, I'm kind of struggling remembering, but it's okay. It's all right. I'm gonna go ahead and do magic. This time we're gonna do concussive slime. I think I determined that this was, they were weak to this. We'll go ahead and do a stun type deal though. Firearm, reload, crack shot freezer again. Let's go. Pium. They got stunned, awesome. Fire Wisp is gone. Fire Wisp is down. They didn't regain balance. Took 1.5 nightmare damage. Ow. Actually, not very much ow. You guys are starting to really suck, you know that? I'm starting to really tear you apart. Let's just do regular attacks and see what that looks like. Oh, I should have done a firearm attack. Resist. Look at the Priestess of Flora. It's so cool. I do love the custom elements here. Um, we're not looking at like typical fire, water, earth, air, lightning, holy uh, darkness. This has religious implications like Noctivox, Mono Eye. There is fire and ice. And I have a one, exactly like one spell out of the whole gamut that is uh, an excellent hit. Wow, cool. And we get a crack shot. That's awesome. She shot from the hip. Oh, she's a quick draw. A weak draw. A weak draw, McGraw. My head's about leveled up. As if she needed to. She's got frostbite and slicing tornado. Static gloves. What? What that? What to do? What to do? What to do? Wearing them makes your arms and hands tingle as if charged with static electricity. Plus 15 max MP. Loses three defense, but gets a ton of magic attack. Whoa. You know who could use that? <clears throat> Maybe. Maybe Oiki. Um, so, thinking about this. Do I need the gun? I don't think I need the gun. I'm going to go ahead and put this on, I think. What did I have before? I had the light rings. So if I 
compare that with this, uh, losing 11 magic defense, getting 15, no, 12, 12 magic attack, losing uh, 8, 9, 10, 11 defense, don't like that, getting 3 agility, don't like that, getting 15 max MP, not really, not really a, a concern of mine right now. Uh, I like her having the gun. I like her having the gun. So I'm gonna I'm gonna just stick with that for now because her having being able to attack effectively when she doesn't need to heal is a thing. That is a that is that is the moment. That is that is the night. What else can we sell at this point? We've got purity powder, we can go ahead and liquidate. And then like if I have just a row, a single row of items, that's fine. That means I don't have anything new or special just yet. Okay. Yeah. And we can use this chance to buy Neophyte Syrup, which I don't have a lot of. But that's going to help me with a net positive of every time I win a battle, uh, and the battles are tough, every time I win a battle, I come out less, but um, I need a net positive, which means getting enough gold or items from the battle to be able to sell to buy recovery things that will allow me to be in better shape than I was when I entered the battle to begin with. As long as you have a net positive, you can use an area to grind. And we have a net positive, so we can use this area to grind. <clears throat> that is advice I give to you for free. See that? We're fine. We're fine. And I'm going to go ahead and save that too, just in case I, I get unalived. We have buildings to clear. We have this building to clear. We have this building to clear. And it's going to be scary because we have in both of these buildings enemies that are running around on their own and we have random encounters so we're going to run in there take out the enemies that are walking around get rid of that threat and then we'll look for the goal of the little legacy dungeon room and we'll do that for this one too but this one looks a lot more frightening because there's like darkness and, and light effects and stuff, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. And there's something just running straight for me. So that's in the next episode though. I'm done for now. Thank you very much for watching. A huge thank you to the ever supportive, ever kind and brilliant Beaver Dev, otherwise known as Botaniki Dev, for creating this experience in this short amount of time. Well, not really a short amount of time for this jam. It is very ambitious and it's a lot of fun. And if you have an RPG Maker game that you'd like for me to play, fat chance this is not an RPG Maker channel. See you next time.